call to order this meeting of the Mayor and Council of the City of LaGrange. We will begin with an invocation to be offered by Councilman McKamey to be followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand. Mr. God, our Father, we thank you for this evening. We thank you for everyone that is in this council chambers tonight, and we pray that you would open our minds and our hearts to your governorship, and we pray that everything that is done will glorify, honor, and praise you. We thank you for those who are yielding themselves to the citizenry of LaGrange. God, we pray right now for the people in Colorado, and we pray for the people in the Atlanta area, we pray for the violence in this world. We just ask that you would have mercy. In Jesus' name we do pray. Amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Council members have all been given a copy of the minutes of our regular council meeting held on March the 9th. I would entertain a motion. Motion to approve. Second. Second. Have a motion second to approve. Is there any discussion? All those in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? No. That passes unanimously. Uh, scrolling down to reports. Do any council members have anything to report tonight? No report tonight. No report. No report. Okay. City Manager report, Ms. Kelsey. Uh, yes, sir. Dawson Street Redevelopment Plan. We had a lengthy review of, of that plan this morning. Uh, that's in reference to the school there as well as some adjacent parcels that the city owns around the school. Uh, staff would recommend that uh, council call for a public hearing uh, be held on April the 13th to gain citizen input on that plan. Motion to call, call for a public hearing. Second. I have a motion and a second to call for a public hearing. Is there any discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? No. That passes unanimously. Under re Oh, sorry, Ms. Kelsey, anything else? That's all, Mr. Mayor. Under resolutions, we have a resolution authorizing the mayor and clerk to execute an intergovernmental agreement with Troop County regarding water line extension. Uh, yes, sir, Mayor. We have been approached by the Board of Education as well as Troop County about um, extending water line services down to the Rosemont School. As you know, in the East Boss, they plan to build a new elementary school adjacent to the existing Rosemont site and have been uh, for some time looking for water service in that area. Under this um, agreement, the county would pay us 500000 the Board of Education another 500000 and the city would pay the balance of, of that construction project, which we do have um, budgeted in the new uh, water and sewer bond. We'd like to answer any questions. Staff will recommend approval of this agreement. Move to approve. Second. Have a motion second to approve the resolution. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed, no. That passes unanimously. We have no first readings. We have a sec second readings of ordinances tonight, um, which include rezoning ordinances. And for the record, I would make a note of the fact that all council members have the rezoning evaluation considerations at their places. Um, the Motion to the table. The, the, well, the, fir the first is a rezoning at 508 Greenville Street, which I believe council may have an interest in tabling the second reading till the April 13th meeting. Is that correct, Ms. Yes. Yes, I'd like to table uh, section A of the second reading of the ordinance. Okay. Second. So I have a motion, a second to table the second reading of the rezoning of 508 Greenville Street <coughs> to our April 13th meeting. Is there any discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? No. And that passes unanimously. Under second readings, we also have an ordinance rezoning property at 507 Jenkins Street from R2 residential to OIR office institutional residential. Motion to approve. We have to have the second reading first. <laughs> so that, mo that motion is out of order. Out of, out order. of order. Out of order. <laughs> an ordinance of the Mayor and Council of the City of LaGrange to amend the code of the city to amend the zoning map and ordinances of the city so as to reclassify the use zone of real estate located at 507 Jenkins Street and owned by Angapali Rajiv to repeal conflicting ordinances to fix an effective date and for other purposes. Motion to approve. <laughs> I have a motion to approve. Is there a second? I have a motion and a second to approve of any discussion. Councilman McCain, would you like to make a statement for the record? For the record, I'd just like to say that Dr. Rajiv is one of my doctors. Okay. All right. Any, uh, any more discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed, no. That passes unanimously. Um, we also have a second reading amending the alcoholic beverages ordinance relating to brown bagging. An ordinance of the Mayor and Council of the City of LaGrange to amend the alcoholic beverages ordinance relating to brown bagging to provide for the charge of violating the brown bagging ordinance against an owner after notice 
to provide for penalties to repeal conflicting ordinances to fix an effective date and for other purposes. Second. I have a motion and a second to approve. Is there any discussion? Does that apply to any other colored bag? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> the, color, the color of the bag is not the uh, not dispositive. Feature. Not dispositive. Yeah, it's, it's brown bag. <clears throat> and, um, any other discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed no? And that passes unanimously. Um, we will move on to board and agency appointments, and we have five appointments to the Downtown Development Authority of the City of LaGrange, also known as DDA2. Four-year terms to succeed Joe Ragland, Heather Graham, Trip Penn, Janice Burks-Davidson, Burks and Al Brannan. Mr. Mayor, I'd like to make a motion to reappoint. Is there second. I have a motion second to reappoint these five members of DDA2. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed, no. That passes unanimously. Under the LaGrange Troop County Hospital Authority, we have a three-year term to succeed Jerome Alford. Under the provisions of the Hospital Authority, the City Council is required to submit three names to the Hospital Authority, and they select from those three names one individual to serve on that board. Um, is there a motion? I'd like to have a motion that we nominate Deborah Boswell. What was the Gates? Brittany Gates. Brittany Gates and Nate Kelsey. Kelsey. Okay. Is there a second? I second. Okay. So I have a motion and a second uh, to submit uh, Dorothy. Deborah Boswell. Deborah Boswell, Brittany Gates, and Meg Kelsey. Any discussion? I, I want to just uh, raise the question or, or a clarification that you could not succeed yourself. You, you have to choose somebody different at the end of that three-year term. No, that's not correct. You can, you could, you can, there's no, there's no term limit. Okay. And did we, did we inquire as to whether... The letter uh, seemed to indicate that he, that we needed a new, is that... I think he is, uh, I don't have... He the, has some other things going okay. on. Okay, so. yeah. Right. yeah, yeah. That was in the letter. That was in, that was in the letter we received from... Yeah, thank you. Coleman Fox, but... So that, that answers okay. my question. I'm, I'm prepared to vote. The legislature asked they didn't submit the Right. Okay, any discussion? All in favor, say aye. 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 Any opposed, no? That passes unanimously. Okay. <coughs> Is uh, Ms. Van Schuer, would you like to close us? Yes, sir. No video for tonight. It's going to be real quick. The good news for tonight. Just wanted to give everybody a reminder that our youth council is going to be presenting to the mayor and council next meeting. That's Tuesday, April 13th. Our young leaders are going to be presenting to you their two big projects they've been working on at the helm of our chairperson, Zoe Mitchell. She's been doing a great job. Our two um, projects will be focusing on mental health and mentorship. And then we'd also like to invite every one of y'all to be a part of the social afterwards at Los Natales. We'll do um, a social so that you can meet our young emerging leaders. So no video. Wonderful. Yes, well, not a record, but less than 10 minutes. We stand adjourned.